ExpressVPN Guide, Configure NS Server in Windows 7 and Windows 10. Manually configuring your Windows computer with other DNS server addresses can help you access blocked sites and enjoy faster speeds. To configure your Windows computer, please follow the instructions below. Contents, open the network connection settings. Set the DNS server addresses. Set ExpressVPN's DNS settings. A note about PPPoE. Part 1, open the network connection settings. Press and hold the Windows logo key and press R, Win plus R, in the network connections window, find the connection through which you connect to the internet. Usually this is local area connection or wireless network connection. If you use both, perform the following steps on both. Right-click the connection and select properties, part 2, set the DNS server addresses. Double-click internet protocol version 4, if that doesn't appear, just internet protocol select use the following DNS server addresses, and type the following Google DNS server addresses, preferred DNS server, 8.8.8.8. Alternate DNS server, 8.8.4.4. If Google DNS is blocked for you, please try, Newstar DNS Advantage, 156.154.70.1 and 156.154.71.1, or LEVEL3 DNS, 4.2.2.1 and 4.2.2.2. Enter the addresses, then select OK, and OK. Part 3, Set ExpressVPN's DNS Settings. Now we have to change ExpressVPN's DNS Settings. For ExpressVPN 5.x, click the three dots, then click Options. Select the Advanced tab. Uncheck the box for only use ExpressVPN DNS servers while connected to the VPN, then click OK. For ExpressVPN 4.2, click the three dots, then click Options. Select the Advanced tab. Uncheck the box for only use ExpressVPN DNS servers while connected to the VPN, then click OK. For ExpressVPN 4.0 and 4.1, click the three dots, then click Options. From the General tab, uncheck the box for only use ExpressVPN DNS servers while connected to the VPN, then click OK. For ExpressVPN 3.x, go to Options and uncheck the option that says only use DNS servers set by the VPN. Part 4, a note about PPPoE. If you're connecting to your ISP via a PPPoE connection, then set the DNS servers on the PPPoE connection itself and then restart your computer for the DNS settings to take effect.